Hey guys, welcome back to Profe Plays Minecraft. Here we have another tutorial. Uh, this is the chicken multiplicationator. Yeah, so it's a uh, chicken farm that we're making. And I know what you're thinking. Why do I need a chicken farm if I could just throw down some fences and feed them lots of seeds? Well, this chicken farm is a ton of fun to build. The chickens lay eggs and those eggs hatch automatically so you essentially don't have to do anything for the chickens to multiply as long as you have a couple of chickens to get started. And this may sound terrible but once this thing is full you can hop in there and start hacking away with the sword and you're going to get tons of chicken meat and feathers which go down into a chest down here. And as long as you leave a couple of chickens remaining, you do not have to worry about starting your farm over. It will automatically do it for you. Here is what you need for this build. Pause the video if you need to and take note of what you need. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. First, you need to lay down a double chest. And behind that chest, you need to put a hopper. And then on top of that hopper, you need to place another hopper. Behind this hopper combo, you need to place a dropper facing up, and on top of that, a dispenser facing up. You'll have to crouch quick to do that. Behind the dropper, you need to place a comparator, a repeater, and a redstone loop, making a redstone clock. This is going to read when there are eggs in here and push them up through the dispenser. You'll need another piece of redstone here and here, and then the repeater going back in to the dropper. Okay, here's the more expensive part of the build. Uh, you are going to need a lot of hoppers. You can make this build a little smaller and so it's a little less costly. Uh, I just like making it this size because it's more comfortable. So crouch click and place a hopper going this time into the dropper, not into the chest. Place another hopper on top of that. And then place another hopper there. Okay, now every hopper that you lay down from this point on needs to somehow, whether that's through another hopper or directly, lead back to this hopper right here. So, uh, crouch click, and another hopper, and another hopper. Then crouch click and come back. We're making a five by five hopper platform, so make sure you have five. Careful, do not get confused and place a hopper going into the dispenser because this machine will not work like that. Okay, when you're done, you should have something that looks like this. It's a five by five hopper platform with the exception of this one spot, which is your dispenser. That was the hardest part of the build. Now you just need to come and place slabs on top of each one of these hoppers. Okay, you do not want to put a slab on top of the hopper that goes down into the chest and you don't want to put a slab on top of the dispenser. Here you can actually either put on another slab or you can make it a full block. Then you'll want to put a block on top of that and a block here. Now take the building blocks of your choice and build columns that are five high. You can do this all the way around. Okay, over here above this chest, you just want to leave a gap so that you can open it. And I like to cover this gap with glass so that it's enclosed and you can still open your chest. Now come back here uh, and you are going to make a set of stairs leading down just diagonally across the face. You can make those actual stairs, I just leave them as blocks. 
here on the inside you can place two ladders so that you're able to get out. Then you can place your water source here. It should be flowing down into that hopper. We are basically done here. Let me just show you how to get your chickens inside. Okay, to lure your chickens in, you will need some seeds. Pull out the seeds. Chickens should pay attention to you. Back up. Start making your way up your stairs. Then once you get high enough, go ahead and fall in the hole. The chickens will come down to you. All right, and uh, there we go. You just need a couple chickens to get started. And it takes it a while to get going, but once this thing gets going, these chickens are going to multiply exponentially. Another way to get this farm going is to build a little mini egg farm. Sometimes that works a little bit better so that you can uh, have some eggs to start with. We're gonna lay down a chest. Put a hopper in the back of that chest. Put a stone slab on top of that hopper, which you really don't need, it just makes it look nicer. Go four high. And then I like to put glass so I can see what's going on. Go ahead and build a walkway coming down so that you can get your chickens in there. Take your seed. Same concept. Jump up on these blocks so that the chickens come up here. <laughs> Try not to fall in. If you need to, you can put a ladder there. Wait until the chickens come around. They don't like to fall in this hole, so if you go around slowly, you can kind of nudge them in. Okay guys, another way to get this farm going very, very quickly uh, is sometimes it really does take a while to get going, especially if you only start with two chickens. So another way is to obviously use seeds and run around and feed your chickens and they will multiply like that. Uh, if you have a seed farm, it makes it really easy to do every day. And then another thing you can do is you can add a side feeder over here where you have chickens that are only used for laying eggs. You never kill those and those feed into the system. Uh, and you can fill that up with a couple chickens and feed them until they multiply into lots of chickens. Let me show you how to make that side feeder for chickens. Come over here to the side, break the second block up, crouch, put a hopper, crouch, put a hopper. Build up walls all the way around that are at least two above the hopper. Place down a slab. And then you have to get chickens in here as well, so you will probably need to put some stairs. Pull out your seat. get chickens to follow you. I'm gonna build an extra column here so it's easier for me to maneuver around. Once your chickens are close, you come around like this, like the egg farm, and slowly push them in. Try and get two chickens in there. There you go. 
And then you feed, every time you feed these chickens in here, the seed, you come by and feed these as well so they multiply as well, making the farm go faster and faster and faster. Okay guys, uh, I've been letting this farm go for about an hour. Uh, I did feed a couple of the chicken seeds at one point, um, and I, <laughs> I killed myself here. So you see I'm up to uh, 7 XP, um, but watch how fast my XP goes up by feeding the chickens. Got to run around, feed them. So in just a couple seconds, I got two x two bars of XP. Um, always remember, and I didn't even use that much seed. Always remember to feed your chickens that are here in this part of the feeder. So that they keep multiplying and this was basically empty an hour ago and now it's full of chickens and if I leave it it's going to get more and more full. Now uh, the, the other thing that I was saying is you can come in here and hack away so you're going to get XP and uh, feathers. Now the baby chickens are probably shouldn't be getting them. that's okay. They don't give you anything. Um, so you get XP, chicken meat, and all the stuff goes through the system. Um, and starts going into your chest, which I'll show you as soon as I go down. All right, there we go. And that is the chicken multiplicatinator. Good luck.